All right, so this is for uh, Rodriguez Pinto. Um, the first thing I would say is, is and he's using a uh, the YouTube video, and I'll put the, the clip in there. Um, but the first and foremost thing that I would say right off the bat is that you want to go darker with your values, okay? Um, right now, you I would tell you to blow up the head a little bit. You can see I scaled up the head a little bit, and it's angled a little bit off. So you want to use measurement a little tighter measurements on your um, your character. So the head is is angled a little bit more, things like that. So just pay attention to the proportions like that. And I use my my pencil to kind of use that to measure the angles. Um, and so I use other points on the body too to kind of go back and forth and measure you know, different angles and things like that. And it looks like for the most part you did a pretty similar job um, doing that, but there's little bits of things that are a little bit off, like the, uh, the arm looks a little bit awkward. You have to realize that the elbow would come here and it would be significantly longer, um, something along the lines of like this. And then it would, you know, you'd have your bone here, so it doesn't kind of float up like that. But that aside, the values, the first thing is in the photo, you're looking at that red chair. And um, that red chair is significantly darker. Um, it's almost, if you, if you desaturate that photo, it's almost strictly black in some areas. Um, and it still has the highlights on there. But that's the first thing that I would say. And then she, as, a, as her... Uh, character is significantly darker too and you can see I did a little bit of a paint over here um, going in through and kind of revising some of the, the little bit of a, a scenery here but overall her character is very very um, uh, significantly tanner thus making her darker the other thing I would tell you is that you kind of tend to flatten out some of this stuff here like this is a really good area where you sh you're showing the value range here um, but here is another area where you want to just kind of <clears throat> start kind of cleaning up and kind of refining that darker value system around like so and that will help you get a little bit more roundness in your your overall character um, and just defining that those elements here like so defining those elements and getting the darks in there and that's going to help and then also it's very subtle but she does have a little bit of a bounce light in there um, and so you want to get that in there as well and that that'll help you get the form out a little bit more um, and so ultimately that's kind of what you want to pay attention to is the different layers of form I mean you've got you've got like the muscle structure here um, but then you know this right here is just a little bit brighter um, and then this one like here I would say just just a little bit darker or a little bit lighter and just adding a little bit more light to it very subtly is going to round out that form a little bit more and kind of give you what you want for that that kind of feeling and I would just tell you ultimately that you want to just kind of uh, kind of go up and down instead of uh, left and right like go against the shape so in this case go this way whereas um, the others you know don't don't try and paint this way here when you're blending uh, paint instead this way and I think you'll get a better uh, value value uh, range going on and so ultimately that's something that you want to just kind of look at um, and take care of. All right, I hope that helps.